This is a short biography about Vincent van Gogh and some of his paintings. His paintings are Sunflowers, Blossom Tree, Starry Night, The Irises. Before we talk about his paintings, here is some information about Vincent van Gogh. He was born in the year of 1853 in Holland. His full name is Vincent William van Gogh. He died in the year of 1890. His birthday is March 30th, 1853 in the Netherlands. Sunflowers. Here is a brief understanding of the painting. There are many paintings throughout the galleries of the world that have become the same with the artist's name and techniques. The various painting of the sunflowers and Vincent van Gogh are perfect example of this. Vincent van Gogh sunflowers have been repainted many times by other, other artists, although no one has made it as good as van Gogh. Van Gogh is a perfect person for young, artists to look up to. Van Gogh was crazy but extravagant artist. Looking at these paintings, one begins to notice a flow. The colors are vibrant and express motion, emotions typically asso associated with the life of the sunflowers. Perhaps the technique is what draws one into the painting. This shows the aspect of how the earth ties in, in with each other. Vago began painting with sunflowers when he left Holland to France. Majority of Van Gogh's sunflower and vases were made in Arles, France in 1888 through 1889. Starry Night. Starry Night is one of the most well-known paintings in our generation. Here is the aspect of Starry Night. In the sky, during the night, there is wispy clouds. The stars shine with their own light, in a shining crescent moon. Although the details are a little bit confusing, we all can relate to it. The people that look at Starry Night don't want to stop looking at it. Near the hills lies a small village. There is a peaceful breeze flowing throughout the painting. Starry Night is listed as one of the top masterpieces of all time. Maybe the reason why Starry Night is so well known is because it appeals so strongly to such variety of people worldwide. I wonder why Van Gogh decided to put details that most people don't notice. For instance, the village he put in. I didn't know about the village until we made the screen cast. Van Gogh made Starry Night in Asylum St. Remy. This is a good painting for young artists to look up to. Here's a quote by Vincent Van Gogh. For my part, I know nothing with any certainty, but this is the sight of stars make me dream. Blossom Tree. In 1890, Vincent's brother Theo had a son. Van Gogh was excited to be an uncle. He accepted to have the honor of having a new child named Vincent. When Vincent moved to Arles, he dreamed that everyone could paint together in happiness. Immediately, there was a healthy birth and he started to paint the blossom tree for the baby. Van Gogh must be proud of having friendship with his new nephew. The irises. On May 8, 1889, Vincent van Gogh had to live in a mental hospital called St. Paul de Massol in France. During his stay, he painted 130 paintings, including Starry Night and the irises. Maybe because van Gogh didn't like it or consider it a masterpiece, but van Gogh's brother liked it, so he submitted it along with Starry Night. On the list of most expensive paintings sold, iris the irises is one of them. 54 million of 1987. Apparently, the irises are on display in the Getty Center in Los Angeles, California. The irises were probably influenced with the Japanese wood block prints. Thanks for watching our screencast. We hope you enjoyed it about Vincent Van Gogh.